When the opportunity arose for a pilot project for the Philadelphia model in Saskatchewan, Regina Police Chief Evan Bray said his hand shot up. He says he strongly believes in the project and hopes it will become permanent after the 17-month pilot is over. The project won't be reviewing past cases, but Bray says he's not shutting the door on those either. It's really about bringing in that outside kind of um, unbiased view and expertise and, and what that looks like. So uh, the intent isn't to go back, it's, it's to continue to go forward. One advocate says police don't always consider the emotional state of survivors. She says they can be rushing, trying to get interviews and things like that. But she says that having her organization involved may help survivors feel more comfortable reporting. There's that level of transparency and, um, and that uh, people that have their best interests uh, you know, first, you know, at the forefront um, will be able to advocate for, for positive change. Miller is one of the people that will be reviewing the case files. Chief Bray also says that he is working closely with the Privacy Commissioner to ensure that all the strict guidelines are met. The provincial government is allocating $122,000 for this project. The project will begin this summer. Emily Pasiak, CBC News, Regina.